So now let us try to calculate the spin only magnetic moments for complexes we have already done previously. So this was the complex we did in this the electron present in the d orbitals were 3 that was 3 d 3. So this is your 3 d orbital 4 s 4 p. I am not drawing the 4D orbital because we know that this was an inner orbital complex. So, these are the electrons of chromium and these are the electrons of NH3. So, there are 3 unpaired electrons in total. So, here I can write 3 into 3 plus 2. So, that is under root 3 into 5. So, that is under root 15 and under root 15 has the value of 3.87. So, the spin only magnetic moment of this complex is 3.87. Now, let us go to the next complex. NiCl4 2 negative. So, this was a tetrahedral complex. In this case, nickel was 3D8. Okay, that is 4P and I have drawn one. Let us fill in the electrons of nickel. So, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 and then let us fill in the electrons of chlorine 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, there are 2 unpaired electrons. So, our n will be 2 substitute that here 2 into 2 plus 2. So, that is under root 8 and under root 2 8 has the value of 2.82. So, this will be 2.82 bar magneton. In the previous one also, it was 3.87 bar magneton. So, this complex has a spin only magnetic moment of 2.82 bar magneton. Mm -hmm.